all right, I'm creating a parts list. It's going to contain a metric part and an English part. So I'm going to create a folder on my C drive. I'm just going to call it my company name and my table files folder. And I'm going to put that information there. I'm going to go back to my um, root installation of where NX has been installed. In this case, I've got an NX12. I'm going to go to GII and my table files folder there. I'm going to copy the table PAX file out of that directory. And if I look at the properties, I can see it is a PAX file. So I'm going to copy that out and paste it into my company directory. I'm also going to ensure that I have write privileges. So my read only is turned off. I'm going to open it up with a text editor or Notepad++, and I'm going to get rid of my palette entries and save that. I need to create an environment variable in an X, or I can go ahead and put it into my um, customer ENV dir directory, but I'm going to put it here for a speed. So I need a variable pointing to my customer templates folder. So I'm going to say new, in caps, UGII, underscore table, underscore templates. I'm going to copy my company directory where my templates have been stored. I'm going to paste that right in there. Go ahead and close that. Start my version of NX, in this case, 12. I'm going to go and look at my log file real quickly and just do a search for table. So I can see that UGII underscore table underscore templates is pointing to my company directory and tables file folder. Go ahead and close that. Opening up my English part, and it's a tabular note. I'm going to right mouse button on it. Save as template. I'm going to put it right back into that same folder. And in this case, just to make it a little bit clearer, I'm just going to do parts list, all one word, and maybe lowercase. Repeat the same process for metric. Okay, so those are both created. I'm going to go ahead and uh, close all my parts. And clear my uh, history. I don't have a tables uh, icon in my resource libraries. So to turn that on, I need to add a preference in here. So file preferences and palettes. I'm going to open a new palette. I'm going to point back to my company folder, tables file folder. And once I'm in there, I'm going to grab that PAX file. So now I do see a table sitting there. So if I create a new drawing format, in this case it's metric, and I'll pick middle of the road size. Come over to my tables, and just for the heck of it, if I pull the English one over and drop it on, I can't because it's an English template. So if I grab my metric, drop it over, that one has been built and works properly. So I'm going to go ahead and say new, and this time I'm going to do an English inches. Drag and drop my English parts list in. So very quickly I was able to create two different parts lists and have them show up in two different types of formats.